What's up guys, it's your super players back at it again. It's your host Tony G bringing you another market watch and definitely smash that like button, be subscribed and comment down below if I miss any particular card that I might have missed today's market watch. Usually they're Mondays, but like I said, I'm moving and I'm so much go is going on in my life right now that I can't throw out a video on a Monday. So I give a huge shout out to C-Rod for holding it down on Mondays. But definitely, either they're gonna be on Wednesdays or Mondays, sorry about that. It's just this big move has been pretty chaotic for me. But, just like in the title, collectors must see because a lot of these SPRs from set one through who knows where are so cheap right now. So there was a big hype early on, earlier this year, that a lot of these cards were over two, $300. It was insane, it was like a buyout, people were selling it, it was just, People were just buying all these cards for an insane amount of price. And now they've tanked so significantly, like it's a perfect time to buy it before they skyrocket again. Like I said, we're gonna start off with God Breaks on Goku from the first set, guys. It's sitting at 94 bucks. It was actually sitting at 100 and something the other day. And now it was at 150, but now it's at 94. These are lightly played if you are okay with that, however, a near mint is still 139. That's still relatively cheap from what it originally was at. It was actually at $250 for one of them, but now it's less than half of that. So it's pretty crazy in my opinion. So if you're trying to look into buying some of these guys collectors, this is the perfect time to buy them. And if you're trying to get into the game and you felt like you missed out, this is probably you might be spending a little bit more than what you expected to but it's actually a lot cheaper now than it was earlier this year and same thing goes with broly uh rampage same thing near mint a hundred dollars guys look at that holy cow that's actually pretty good i might cop that one <laughs> i'm just kidding i don't know you guys might get it before i even buy it right now but yeah so lightly played like i said still sitting at 120 130 near mint 150 so this is still a little bit more expensive than god break but Still cheaper than what originally was. It was sitting at $300. Also, Frieza, another card that was sitting at $120. Now it's at $70. It's probably less than half of that now. And then we go on to other ones. Union Force, they're significantly dropping. So you're seeing this common trend with a lot of the SPRs from older sets are tanking. Either if it's $5, $10, $12, it's tanking right now. This is the perfect time to buy. Just like if you're into stocks and crypto, this is the dip to buy in <laughs> i am not a financial advisor so don't go based on what i just show you definitely do your own research card market huge shout out to the eu they also have significantly cheaper cards at a cheaper price so some of these might even be cheaper over there so if you know someone in the uk or in europe that are willing to help you out definitely help that person out so players and um yeah it's pretty cheap right now. And then we're gonna be talking about promo cards that are sitting at an expensive price because a lot of the new stuff, Cross Spirits, is insanely cool. It's just a must kind of buy card, you know what I mean? And a lot of cool supports coming out and a lot of cards are working really well with some of the new um, cards that are coming out. So you saw this card, this card continuously goes up in price it was sitting at $15 and it went to 20. I was like, oh, this is expensive. And now it's at 67. Holy cow, it's sold out. <laughs> they bought it out, it's at $67. Very strong card, it's a free super combo, I, I call it. You don't draw, but it becomes a free 10K combo if you have five cards or less. And some decks are gonna utilize that like crazy, as long as your leader is, I believe, Cell or um, Android, if I'm not mistaken. No, actually, it's just if you have five cards or less, never mind. <laughs> but it utilizes it with Cell Surge a lot better. And then since we're seeing some new support come out, these are some cards that I recommend picking up because I'm starting to see that there's a very strong card like Rainbow Mass Saiyan. This card would probably work very well with that deck just because it's a nine drop, comes out, you could swing at your opponent, you could play four energy for it. I mean, four energy, he becomes critical, double strike, dual attack. Pretty strong card, very epic. I think it's so good right now. But I think this might work really well with Bardock Mass Saiyans because you're starting to see rainbow colors being utilized in some of these decks. And then we were talking about Pan Heroine's Victory, a card that was actually sitting at a dollar. It's now 12 bucks. It's seen a huge increase over a thousand percent. And it's gonna be work, it's gonna work really well with the new Videl leader. 
I, if you didn't get them or if you have some of these, I would say hold on to them because someone's brewing a very strong deck with that new Videl leader. And it's insanely, look, insanely powerful. And look at that, it's $49, cheapest is 12 bucks. It was actually cheaper than $6. It was actually $3 when I saw it. And I kept pulling this, I pulled this one like a million times when I was participating in the champion uh, events. But this is another card I say keep a lookout. This might go up in price before you know it. Before you blink, it's going to be like $1,000. Just kidding. But it's pretty insane. And then we have Herodogarn, Permanition of Evil Power. This card works very well with the new leader. This leader, uh, the new Herodogarn leader, utilizes Tapion and Minosha in the drop area. You have this guy. Works really well. He's great. Free 7 drop, 20k blocker. So good. And it works really well in that deck because Min uh, Minosha and Tapion need to be in that drop area in order for your leader to awaken with the new Herbergarn from the Cross Spirits. Very good leader. Highly recommend getting it. These are s relatively cheap. I think they have Parallel Foil for about five, six bucks. Yeah, so there you go, 447. I think you should get them. Someone's gonna make a really good Herbergarn deck. <laughs> Tony G, <laughs> I'm looking into it. Um, I will be playing Herbergarn probably in the next set. It's such a good leader. Um, but yeah, I say pick pick them up. They're dirt cheap. See, see, these are the cards that I think are cheap right now. Could get them. Don't spend too much money on it. But then we have Bojack, Rampaging Agent of Destruction. Another great card. This card was sitting at like $60. Now it's at $15. Very good card. I recommend picking it up if you're using Agents of Destruction Leader um, in its name or Bojack Brigade. Still a very strong card if you're using Bojack. Awesome card. But yeah, relatively cheap. And then we're going to go into the Cross Spirits booster boxes. These are the pre-order prices as of now. What we're seeing, obviously there's no prices on some of them, but I want you guys to comment down below what you think is going to be the most expensive card from the set besides Seeker Rares. Let me know in the in the comment section. Let all your super players out there know because I'm going to be building this beautiful beast of a card. Uh, I'm going to make a deck out of that guy because I loved her regard when it came out. I love this one too, so I'm definitely going to be making that. Uh, I'm going to be utilizing that leader. But definitely comment down below what you think is going to be your favorite SR, Rare, SPR. They're actually showing the SPRs of, as of now. This card is so strong. It's a topo for green. I think that's nuts in my opinion. But then we got this beautiful card right here. If you guys haven't gotten this card, this card is very strong as well, the Seeker Rare. So keep a lookout. It's a nasty card. If you haven't gotten it, definitely pre-order it when it's cheaper though <laughs> not three hundred dollars um and then we go on to cross worlds i wanted to talk about this set as well because like i said collectors must be aware it's relatively cheap right now if you're trying to get sprs they're all tanking by like 12 to 15 dollars so definitely definitely check them out and if i missed any cards definitely comment down below if i missed anything or comment the cards that you're so hyped to get from the new uh cross spirit set utilize spirit boosted mechanic that's coming out so there you guys have it smash that like button comment down below and let your super players know which cards you're going to be purchasing in the next set all right everybody i will see you guys on the next market watch stay super